Hi, Jonathan Pickup. Welcome to my podcast, 114. I was talking to a friend of mine in England today, Steve, and I was showing him a really quick way of editing viewport crops. So I've recorded it so you can all see it. Hi, Steve. How you doing? Hi, Jonathan. Pretty good, mate. How are you? Good, good. Steve, you and I were talking about how we edit viewport crops. Let me show you this trick I just discovered. Okay, go it's ahead. the clip tool. And even though I've only got the viewport selected and I've got the clip tool, Watch what happens to my viewport. I can actually clip parts of the viewport out without going into enter it. That's seriously cool. I can clip the whole inside of a room out. Watch this. Just clip out the whole inside of a room. And it's gone. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and this clip tool, I've been using it a bit more lately. I used to dismiss it as a sort of a, a funny little tool, but it has become very powerful in the way that it works. You can even clip a polygon out. So I could clip a polygon shape out of my room. There it is. And away it goes. And away it goes. Now the other the idea would be that it, that um, you'd have another viewport underneath with proposed changes maybe. Yeah. And that way you could have both, you know, the existing and the proposed on the same on the same sheet of paper. But I thought that yeah, was that pretty cool. Pretty, yeah, that's pretty cool. Very cool. Thanks for your time, Steve. No problem, John. Thanks for watching. A lot of my clients don't realize that actually I do a lot of the support online with people like Steve and, and other clients. So if you do need help online to get the best from Vectorworks, give me a call, archoncad.co.nz.